just moments away from the opening tip-off between the Bucks and the Nets, an Eastern Conference battle at Continental Airlines Arena, East Rutherford, New Jersey, and the Nets looking to improve on last year's 42-40 and season that saw them lose in the first round of the playoffs at the hands of the Miami Heat. The Nets retooled for sure with Richard Jefferson back healthy again to join Vince Carter and Jason Kidd for a big three perimeter tandem. It should put a lot of pressure on opposing defenses. We're going to send you out to Continental Airlines Arena as they get ready for the opening tip. position in his eighth year from North Carolina, 6'6", number 15, Vince Carter. At one forward position, his fifth year from Stanford, 7 foot, number 35, Jason Collins. At the center position in his second year from Serbia, Montenegro, 7 foot, number 12, Ninad Kristic. The other forward position is fifth year from Arizona, 6'7", number 24, Richard Jefferson. And at the other guard position is 12th year from Cal, 6'4", number 5, the captain, Jason King. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2005-06 New Jersey Nets. New Jersey Nets starting lineup has been introduced to the home crowd. We're going to send you out to Marv Albert and Mark Jackson to tip things off. Last night in Philadelphia beat the Sixers 117-108 and mark this a new look Milwaukee team. Terry Stotts replacing Terry Porter. They won the draft lottery. They selected Andrew Bogut out of the University of Utah by way of Australia as the number one pick. Bobby Simmons, a good pickup as a free agent. And last week, they trade Desmond Mason and a number one for Jamal McGlaw, who was in the starting lineup. Well, this is a new look Milwaukee Buck basketball team, and they are very excited about the prospects of this season. C.J. Ford returning after missing the entire 2004-2005 season. Sat out with that spinal cord injury, required surgery. Pretty good bounce back last night. He was one rebound short of a triple-double. And he really played Allen Iverson extremely well. 